Welcome to Real Food in a Fast World. Today we're taking cream off a gallon of raw milk. And the very first thing I like to do is clean the bottom of the jug. It's the dirtiest part, as you can imagine. So I have a little solution. It's dish soap and water. It's pretty mild, but it's also food safe. And I'm also mostly going to clean on this little corner here. That's where I'm going to pierce the jug. And so once I have that cleaned off, I'm going to take a knife and some sort of a container over to our sink. And I'll meet you there. Okay, so the very first thing I do is I take the cap off of the milk. If I don't do that, it will create a vortex and pour, pull the cream down through the bottom of the jug. Um, and you can see I've got an iced tea container in my sink. I really like this because I can pour the milk in it and then my kids can easily get a drink of milk from the fridge. Um, it doesn't have the biggest opening, so I tend to make a mess in the sink right at first, but I hopefully won't make too big of a mess this time. It's convenient for me, so I like to do it this way and just keep everything in the same jug that I empty it in. Okay, so what I'm going to do is make a hole with my knife right in the edge of this uh, jug and I want it on the handle side and once I poke my knife in I'm going to give it a turn so I have a bigger hole. So you can see it sprayed out a little bit and if I had a bigger bowl I probably wouldn't make as big of a mess. But like I say, I don't like to wash more than one dish, so I do it all in the same container. Now, what I'm watching is I'm watching this cream line go down. And once it reaches the bottom, I'll tip the jug up, and then I have my cream. So it just takes a minute, depending on the size of your hole. Kind of even angle it. Um, so I get that very last bit of milk out. Okay, and then I just tip it up and here I have my cream. From here I can make cultured butter, I can make fresh cream butter, I can use it to make ice cream or pour over fresh fruit, whatever I would like. 